with this. I mean, you watch it all the time, every year, it's, and it's getting bigger and bigger every year, especially in Sweden. I mean, it's the Swedish Melody Festival is very popular in all of Europe, so um, you grew up with it. And as for myself, I started as a backup singer. I was in the house choir for three years. So I've been in Eurovision with uh, Fame, Liana, Martin Stenmark, uh, yeah, I, I guess that's it. And Antique with, and, and with it's Shirley. Me and Jenny, we, we did the, uh, the backing vocals for uh, Antique in Eurovision 2001. Have you seen it? You, look into my Have you seen it? Scene. Yes. And of course, when you compete in uh, Svenska Melodi Festivalen, of course, Eurovision is the goal. It, it's, the, it's the big goal. And there's uh, many small goals on the way. It's good to sing in television and, you know, come out with a new song and blah, blah, blah. But the big goal is Eurovision Song Contest, so it's pretty uh, loaded uh, subject. I also think it's like a great place to come together. I mean, you meet people from all over Europe. It's amazing. You have so much fun and you meet new friends and, you know, everybody's happy. Because music makes you happy, so it's, it's a great, great thing. I mean, neither of us, but like saying this, neither of you have won Melody Festival then yet, but your songs have okay, all become... Okay, thank you. <laughs> but I was really close. Yeah, very close, very close. But your songs I was have... It hurts. Don't. It hurts. Oh, sorry. But they were... I'm not know, a comedian. Uh, even your songs in from the Swedish uh, Melody Festival have become classics for international yes. Eurovision fans. What's that like to suddenly get fans from it's all across the world coming up to you saying, I love you, show It's amazing, but, but one thing, I... I sang in Spain and in uh, England um, my Swedish songs, and they asked me, "When you come back next year, please have Min Shalik and Atelskade in, in English." So I did it. I went into the studio and just, you know, recorded the English versions. And when I come back, they all they sang along in Swedish. So I was like, uh, so like and that's quite somebody's. impressive because Swedish is a difficult language." So, so. why did I do that? <laughs> Good question. They, they, they just wanted you to, to do it, you know. Oh, as That's my me, job. For me, I sing in English, so I don't have that problem. No, I don't. And, and I never made it to the final or anything, but my uh, songs became big hits. So I'm very grateful for that, because that's also what you want. You want your songs to continue living after the Melody Festival. And especially in Europe, uh, I think I tour more is, in Europe than in Sweden. Yes, actually. and that is one of the the, the the apart goals that I was talking about before. That uh, Velvet is uh, known uh, as a big star, but she didn't even make it to the finals. It's really hello. It's she even better. She can be in the competition. <laughs> That's what we're getting. She can at. still do the competition, uh, like uh, you know, coming from. Under, what do you say? <laughs> um, under dog. Under, under, under dog. dog. Yeah, that's true. That's correct. Because she's still uh, like, a, hello, this is me. Uh, it's harder for me. People expect, uh, expecting more, maybe. So if you, uh, are you in the competition this year? Yes. So maybe you have to win because you came in the second place. So now you have to win. Uh, otherwise, you're bad. <laughs> ah, is no. that a scary thought to go into yeah. knowing there are expectations of yes. you? Yes. I mean, this year it's been, or every year that passes by, it's getting more and more difficult. They call it the veterans. They're kicked out one by one, you know. And it's so funny, it's just a media thing. I mean, yeah, but they're still in it. You know, people want to see them, it doesn't matter. Uh, I can speak for myself, I don't matter if I win, or of course it's fun, but it's, it's all about the competition and having fun and getting your music out there. It's, and for me, uh, several years ago, I was like, my goal was really, you know, Eurovision Song Contest. I would like to sing for Sweden and this big ballad in a big, big dress, no? In a beautiful dress. A big dress. <laughs> you want to yeah, you you borrow be, mine? It can be the size of a medium, but it could be the big, like some. Like, a, like mine. Yes, oh my God. No, no, no dress the queen, can ever and be And the queen, that. that was absolutely... But uh, a few years ago, that was my goal. Now it's like, you know, it's really nice and good to be a part of the competition. It's, mm. Which of your songs are most popular amongst the international fans? Do you have one song you know that this this is going to get them all dancing? 
I have at Elska Day and Min Sharik, I guess. Maybe Min Sharik. I think all of them. I think because but the queen maybe it's the queen yeah but mi amor was song of the year in a uh, bulgarian something like this deja vu uh, is very popular uh, i don't sing it that much but it's a very good song <laughs> um, and the queen of course it's very memorable for the performance and the dress and, and i love i love the queen it's it's fantastic and the velvet also have uh, it's fun when you love your songs, right? Yeah. Thank God. <laughs> it, it shows. But uh, when you're on stage as well, it shows that you love your music. And the, the hits before Maldives Talk is a big, big hits for Velvet as well. Uh, I have my six albums uh, in my uh, bag, but uh, it's Swedish, so it's hard to... But, but I, I, I recognize that when I... Uh, were in uh, when I uh, you know in Spain and I sang for them so they knew the lyrics on, on my album tracks as well. It's fun. Now we're going to be seeing a lot of you both over the next ten days on the other side of the building. Yes. I went through there. Oh my God! It's a big stage. Glitter balls yes. everywhere. Yes. And, 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 and a star sky. And the big dress isn't. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> In the corner. I don't know where. <laughs> no, we have a, we have a live band and the, yes. uh, great musicians and uh, a backing vocal girl uh, named Christina and we have uh, done we we dancers have, and it's going to yes, be amazing. Yes, yes. We've been planning what we're going to do. And Jenny is going to dance her ugly dance. Really? Can you show? <laughs> no, I'm not going to show my ugly. It's really dance. ugly. <laughs> you, you 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 can't believe that she can get ugly, but she can. <laughs> When she dances and have this certain look on your face, it's really, it's like Patsy and Edwina, <laughs> you know. Yeah, we are like that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you will see lots. I mean, that's also what's so much fun about this, because we got to know each other 16 years ago and worked together, and we have so much chemistry between us that when we get together, it's like, yes, we never shut up, you know? No. I've never talked so much when I, as I do when I'm with her. No. Um, and I, it's I, funny I, it's because I don't talk much. Really? <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, compared, she does. compared to Passion and Vina, we don't have that much alcohol involved in, in our relationship. I, no. I, can, I can tell you that. Uh, maybe, you know, some Saturdays. Some days. Yes. No, but it's going to be so fun to show everybody how it was so many years ago and you know how much fun we have on stage and it sounds really good with the voices together and you know we have so much fun it's and we, and the history and we're going to start with our songs yeah the schlager songs mm. yeah on with friday this the band, premiere on friday <laughs> and then next week uh, tuesday and thursday it's going to be the way it was when we when we started you know like with, with our live band and you got to see we, a new side of show. We, we are going to do a lot of covers, uh, you know, our our uh, uh, raw models, yes, and you know, Beyonce, maybe Whitney, I don't know, uh, all all kind of. Uh, I was going to say, are we going to see a new side of you yes. because you get a whole, you know, it's a, a long time to be definitely. Born. Yeah, maybe this is this is how I got to know Shirley. Like yeah, she's a soul, the, the soul queen. Like, yeah, because the, the, the girl Rita who like to. Ah, like, and it means it's a big deal. <laughs> but I like I love my Swedish songs. But I started out as a, uh, some kind of soul singer uh, twenty years ago. And of course, it's not going to just be you two on stage. You're going to have some no. very special guests. Yes. As well. Can we? Can we? Uh, can tell? we I don't announce know. it or what? I don't. It's kind of it's kind of secret. <laughs> we, we we can we can we can tell you that uh, on what, Saturday what? is a very special guest. Yeah, and she's really really big. Is she? No, not big, but you know, big, uh, like a superstar. Yeah. From uh, another country, in in a way. In a way. Yeah. Oh, we don't really want to reveal taster, anything. You have, to come. you have and to come. And we always perform midnight from midnight. We're, we're so trying to like hold so it doesn't get too late. So. Twelve o'clock in the night till one o'clock. It's it's an hour 
just, you know. Please come and have fun and dance. And, and the stage you know. will burn. It's like, you know, it's really one hour just wah, rock and roll. And you know, on Friday, next Friday, we have a competition called the Eurostar. Yeah, tell me about that. Oh, it's so um, fun. And they are good. Yes. All of them are really good. It's really hard to choose. Uh, now, we ask people to like sing one of our songs. They can choose anyone they want and do it any way they want. And uh, they get to perform live here on stage. So we're going to pick out six, six of them and we'll perform here. So it will be nice to just get the people, the fans, to perform. And of there's course a lot of have, talents out there. Yes, there are. There is. And we have a, a Swedish guest artist as well. As well. Of course. And of course they are also big superstars. Not only, from the, the, Festival, not only the, the one from, uh, you know, the one we talked about before. <laughs> the, the Swedish artists are really uh, two of the biggest Nordi Festival stars in Sweden. First of all, you have to be here on Friday, because that's where we're going to perform and have a premiere with our, with our band. And on Saturday. Should we reveal the artist? Yes? The, 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 the Can you guess? Very good. Well did you know or did we are we bad liars? <laughs> ah, so you figure it out now. Ah. So our good friend Eurovision winner. Eurovision winner. And it's really fun that you know we've been we we met her uh oh, 16 or 15 or 14 years ago when we uh, how many years is it? 15. 2001. Yeah. 15. Oh sorry. Uh, so uh, it's it's a friend as well, and when we three when we three get together, it's it's the same. <laughs> you know. Did you ever visit Euro Club when you were backing singers? When you did you go there? Did you feel what it's like to be an artist and to yes, party? yes. And and I have to say, like I've been there, like when I was with the other artist as a backup singer, it didn't happen so much things and. It feels like it, they really put an effort in this year and there's so many things going on. So, and we really get, got the chance to do whatever yes. we want to do. So we, it's fun that we have a live band. And it's and really fun that Stockholm's, uh, Stockholm City, Stockholm Start, they really want this to happen. Yeah, so and make the best for everybody. Yes. So maybe we can put Stockholm, Eurovision in Stockholm on the map. I've been to uh, Moscow when, when I did this competing. Nay, what is it? Commentator. Commentator. Commentator with Edward Auslian. And so Euro fun. Club were. I, I hope it's, it's going to come a lot of people because it was quite empty. Hello, I'm going to sing a song. So me and Christy Bjorkman and Malena Ernman and uh, you know we were about to sing an ABBA song and it was like. 20, 30 people in the audience. So we really hope that it's, it's going to I mean, change. just the location of this place. I mean, come on. Could it get better? No. It's, really it's beautiful. You see Stockholm, it's the best area around. And the weather, thank the weather gods. Uh, it's been so bad weather, and like this week, it's going to be all sunny, and I'm really happy about it's it. It's nice and warm in here today, yes, actually. Yesterday really it was a bit warm. chilly, but We've today been, it's. Yeah, it's really hot. Oh, uh, yes, I agree. No, but we, you know, you can be outside and you see um, the water, you see the castle. I mean, it's beautiful. It's really beautiful. Fabulous. So, I think. I'm really excited. I am too. It's going to be an amazing two weeks. I think we give Shirley and Velvet a huge round of applause. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Uh, all the best of luck. I hope uh, we all Thank have you. a fabulous time. Thank you, and nice to meet you. So, are you coming back during these two weeks to your club? Listen to us? Good. Yes, okay. Looking forward to see you all. You can, you can give these some instructions. I will remember you. So I will. <laughs> mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you.